So Professor Sangi, thank you so much for being with us today on Sartre TV. You updated your famous book, The Fifth Discipline, in 2010. What's the central thesis? Oh, well, it, the, the book really was an attempt to make sense of many, many years of working with uh, a relatively small number back then of very innovative uh, managers and organizations. And, you know, what seemed to characterize situations where people really worked at their best, individually and collectively. And we didn't even have um, a term like learning organization initially. We, we had a lot of tools and methods because we had been working with systems thinking, and, uh, mental models, and building shared vision, and stuff like that for a long while. Um, but it got to a certain point, and it was really time to kind of organize the experiences. And it was really in the writing of the book, the original book, that the whole idea of five disciplines, as five kind of bodies of theory and method came together, which seemed to encompass much of what the most uh, effective and innovative managers and organizations were doing. Anyhow, so that kind of led ultimately to the book. And it was one of those things, you know, you just had to get it out of the way so you could go back to work. <laughs> I'm, not really, <laughs> I'm not really a writer. You know, people who are writers, that's the main thing they do is write. I, I do it when I have to do it on the side. <laughs>